hello everybody welcome to this new video today i have the full guide for the easter egg and firebase c for you guys so let's get right into it the first part you have to do is pretty much activating the power and that's actually the basic you always have to do to get back a punch i will go really quickly over it but if you want a more in-depth guide for that there is already a video online on my channel about it so start off with going to ravenov next to the back punch and talk to him he will say go to the teleporter then use the teleporter to firebase z go to the three different ether reactors activate them protect them for a bit and do this three times after you have done this go back to ravenov talk to him and you can also pack a punch and use the wonder fizz machine if you listen a little bit to what Ravenov is saying and who he is talking to you can maybe already predict that you have to find that other person the doctor slash scientist who is working for omega this doctor is located in the mission control where also one of the eat reactors is downstairs in his bunker now you just have to talk to him and let him say what he has to say then you have to go back to Ravenov to talk to him again and he will give you a key card now pick up this key card slash id badge and with this id badge you are able to open up three metal closets that are in the map so the first metal closet is located in the spawn itself behind it the first door you can open with points open it up and pick up the serum after you have done this, you are going to do this two more times. Go back to Firebase Z. When you come out of the portal, go to the left and go to the engineering room. There you find also a closet. Open it up. Pick the serum. Let's go to the third place. The third closet is located near Jug. Go upstairs in the colonel office. There you can find the lost serum. Pick up the serum. Now you have picked up the three serums. You can make the truth serum you will be using on the doctor so now you go to the barracks location that is located in the middle of firebase z you go into the field hospital where you should find two devices in my recording one small part got corrupted so i cannot show you the device itself but there should be two devices there put the serum in the red device it will start spinning. There will spawn some hellhounds, so be careful. Wait a little bit until the process is done. Afterwards, pick up the blue device. Now head back to the mission control. Go outside to the left. There should be a vent. Now on the vent, you should be able to put down the agent delivery system. Or the blue device you just picked up. Put it down. Go back to Dr. Peck, who is now just vibing dancing in the bunker he will say some stuff and afterwards you can go to the data center if you chill on the top floor of the data center for a bit eventually weaver will start speaking and the memory transference station will be available at the station you will be able to pick up essence traps that go into your tactical slot with this essence trap you have to capture mimics but really specific mimics I will explain this as easy and as good as possible, but it's pretty difficult. If you're doing it in game, it will make a lot more sense. From this moment, the coming few rounds, it's good if you just leave one zombie alive to just repeat this few steps I'm going to show you now. You will have to find three mimics. Every round, after the round you just finished and picked up the essence trap, there should be one place in the map where a lot of items are dropped on the ground that you cannot pick up. These places are pretty random, so I would just suggest to walk around and to look for a few items lying on the ground. If you cannot find anything, just go to the next round, leave one zombie alive and try to look for them again. If you ever find a location with a lot of items on the ground, one of them will become a mimics. This mimics you have to capture. How do you capture a mimics? Very simple. Get it low, but don't kill it. Put down your trap. It works as a C4. Capture the mimics. Go back to the station. Insert the trap into the machine and pick up another one. Repeat this process three times. Have you ever insert the wrong trap or with the wrong mimics or with a zombie in it or whatever? You can just keep on trying this again until you have done the three right ones you need. How do you know you have the right ones? Whenever you put a trap in the station, somebody will start speaking. If that person ends with giving a code, Weaver will say you have found one. He will say how many you still have to do. And by the way, you don't have to remember the code itself. If you got them all and Weaver has said yes, you have found them all, 
you should get out of the machine a floppy disk. With this floppy disk you can finally go to the next part for the easter egg. This part was really the most difficult one so if there are any questions please leave them in the comments I will answer them as soon as possible. Now go to the planning offices room. There you can find a computer that you can activate. With this computer you can activate and open up the omega portal room. The big metallic ball you always were like bruh why is this here? Why is this not open? How do you open this? Yeah that thing. Now head to there and just check the inside it's pretty nice. Now afterwards you should go back to Dr. Pack and he will start talking again. He will say you that you need Ethereum crystals to go further. Plus after this you will also get a code to open up the closet right next to it. Out of this closet you will get the Ethereum meter. Pick it up because you will need it to find Ethereum crystals. To find the Ethereum crystals you will also need a shovel. This shovel you can find in one of the defense areas. As you can see here on the gameplay it will randomly be here somewhere. So just search around and you will eventually find it. Now we are also on a point that for one of the Ethereum crystals you will also need a Reiki. How do you get a Reiki? You can get a free one by making him. There is already a video about that on my channel. The second way you can get it is by the box but you just really have to be lucky and third option is by trials that you can find in the middle area of firebase z if you get two legendary rewards you have a high chance to get one my friend got two in this game quick tip with this try to start your trials as early as possible to get that reiki as soon as possible just because this gun is pretty OP and will help you in a lot of situations i know you can get something else out of the trials as well if you haven't got it by the trials, you can still make one for free. Now we have all your items, you can finally try to find the crystals. These crystals are saved in canisters, so you have to find three canisters. The order doesn't matter, but I started with the lockdown canister. That is located in the defense side near Juggernaut. Go up to there, go in the middle and you will hear your ether meter beeping. Whenever you are close to the canister, you can dig it up and activate it and it will create a dome and you will have to protect it a lot of enemies will try to attack you so just spray and pray that's my that's my tip there because it's pretty hectic use your ring of fire use your eater eater shroud use whatever you have because it's pretty hectic and survive eventually the dome goes away and you should be able to pick it up now let's go to the second canister the second canister you can find on the left side of firebase z when you go through this door Immediately in front of you, you can dig up this canister. When you dig it up, a lot of, a lot of, a lot of canisters will spawn. And the main goal here is to find the right one. Do not pick any up until you are very sure. The one that you have to pick up has only white smoke in it. So only white smoke. All the other ones will have black particles in it or like black smoke or whatever in black. So it only has to be white smoke. As you can see on screen. If you are very sure it's the right one you can pick it up. If you miss you can just do this next road again. And some mimics will spawn to be annoying. Up to the last canister let's go. The last canister is located near the barracks. If you walk under the stairs where I am now. There you can dig up this canister. This canister will teleport away. And you have to find it in this area. It will randomly be somewhere around here. For this canister you also need a reiki. So without reiki you cannot do this. You have to shoot the grenade launcher of the reiki on top of the canister. Only then you can pick up the canister. Otherwise it will just teleport away and you have to find it again. The next part is really easy. Just go up to every ether reactor and insert an ether crystal into the canisters that's basically what you have to do pretty easy now head back to the omega portal room if you enter the room they will try to open up the portal again but it doesn't work because pack has still all the power and then after a little bit they will talk about how we could get enough power by using the satellite this moment in the game you should stop doing the easter egg and first focus on preparing yourself for the boss battle because the next few steps make sure you get into the boss battle itself so if you're not ready yet, be sure to first pack punch everything, get your perks, get everything you need and prepare yourself. Tomahawks are a really good thing in a boss fight, so keep that in mind. 
When you are ready for the boss fight, you can start the last two steps. The next step is go back to the planning office, go to this computer and you should be able to realign the satellite dish. This computer was a little confusing but it's actually pretty simple. In the middle you have a blue dot and you have to move that blue dot to the yellow stars. If you go over one of the yellow stars, you should see a flag. And if it is not a flag, you have found the right one. Because you need the one with a question mark. If you're on the right one, press X. If you don't know how to move, because that was my problem in the beginning. That I just didn't know how to move my blue dot. It's with your, with your arrows on the left side of your controller. If you have done this, go outside and watch the radar get powered. After this, immediately... Go to the Omega portal room, there if you interact with the terminal you will start your final cutscene with the boss fight and everything in it. I won't spoil it for you guys, so you have to find out for yourself. I gave some tips for the boss fight, it is not that difficult, the only thing you should keep in mind is the zombies, mimics, manglers are the most annoying things in the boss fight, like the boss itself is not too hard. I hope you all found this guide useful. If there are any problems, be sure to ask in the comments. I will react to you as soon as possible. If you made it so far in the video, put easter egg in the comments. Leave a like, consider to subscribe and I will see you all in the next video.